Kicking off our caricature collection at number 17, we have Amanda Lepore, a 44-year-old transgender model and recording artist. Her repeated anti-aging attempts left her looking like this. Ew. Well, we don't know if she was shooting for Jessica Rabbit, but a tragic miss has clearly left her with Bob Hoskins in drag. Next up at number 16, we have Guns N' Roses frontman Axl Rose, who reportedly got cheek implants and a facelift. Can you say Leprechaun? And now firmly grabbing the number 15 spot on our list of original good looks and ruined potential is former French First Lady Carla Bruni, whose puffy face is reportedly the result of multiple Botox injections. We didn't actually have the heart to tell her that the hit TV series The Addams Family was canceled in 1966 and they're no longer casting extras. Aww, too bad. At number 14, we have splash actress Daryl Hannah, who at 51 years of age denies ever having had plastic surgery. Uh-huh. She says it makes people look like Muppets. Well, just take a look at these before and after pictures and tell us which of your favorite characters she reminds you of. At number 13, we have the Duchess of Alba, who, although she is Spanish royalty, certainly didn't get any special assistance from nature. We're thinking about cutting her a pass on this one because after repeated Botox injections, the 57-year-old managed to marry a man 24 years her junior. She had to get the help from somewhere. Our number 12 is reality star Heidi Montag, who at 25 had had 10 procedures in a single day, including a nose job and a facelift. She now says that she regrets those procedures. Yeah, we're stumped too. At number 11, former Playboy Playmate Shauna Sands lip injections have totally changed the appearance of her face. Shauna, honey, we already have a share and one's more than enough. Our number 10, 34-year-old British glamour model Katie Price has gone through extensive surgery, including a nose job and lip injections. We guess she just loved cartoons so much, she finally decided to become one herself. Coming in at our number nine today is actor Mickey Rourke, one of the few stars in Hollywood who will actually admit up front that he's had plastic surgery. He was even so open as to admit that he went to the wrong guy to fix his boxing injuries back in the 1990s. You gotta hand it to the guy for that one. Television actress Nikki Cox makes the list at number eight and was reported to have undergone cheek and lip implants at just 34 years old. Whose idea was that? Cranking up the freakometer at least one whole order of magnitude, we have our number seven, Paul Stanley from KISS, who apparently had a nose job to give his profile more definition. He also is reported to have had a facelift. Reports are unclear as to whether or not he mentioned anything about turning himself into an imp. In at number six, Pete Burns is best known as the singer from the hit, You Spin Me Round Like a Record. He even made a documentary about his plastic surgery nightmare. From where we're standing, it looks like he's still spinning. Coming in at number five is Donatella Versace, whose looks have been reportedly changing drastically every year for the past 10 years. Versace is also reported to keep on hand a ready supply of those sticky name tags that say, hello, my name is. Coming in at number four, soap opera actress Joan Van Ark, best known from Dallas and Knott's Landing, shocked attendees of a charity event she attended by looking completely different than a living human being. It's reported that after the arrival of the coroner, the bystanders were set straight and the party resumed. Reports indicate that after the arrival and confirmation of the coroner, the startled party goers were reassured and the party continued without incident. Johanna Tukainen, Finnish escort, shot to fame after a sex scandal with the country's foreign minister. Apparently, she has undergone numerous procedures in recent years. We decided to let this one go because the pictures are bad enough. Coming in at number two was a woman who at one time was considered the most beautiful in all of Italy. And that's saying something. These days, after an undisclosed number of plastic surgeries, Italy's Michaela Romanini is almost unrecognizable. Words just fail us. Oh, wait a minute. Here's some. What the hell was she thinking? And now for our number one spot on plastic surgery disasters. 
The dubious distinction of our number one spot is held by former beauty queen and television presenter, Bruna Felisberto. Felisberto reportedly underwent procedures for both a nose job and cheek implants. And while we're all unsure of the motivation behind this, one thing is clear. Friends don't let friends go plastic. Sorry, Barbie.